Good morning to all our viewers. We are here to speak to Mr. Danton, who is a principal dealer. He will be giving us tips on how to succeed. My name is Denton Thiel, and I'm a dealer principal or a dealership general manager. Success to me is um, primarily the achievement of my own goals and um, my own targets and things that I set for myself. On top of that is obviously the achievement of uh, targets set by my directors and shareholders. Having fun achieving those targets, growing people in, in my business, uh, giving them different challenges and achieving those challenges. It generally starts with uh, sort of management meetings in the morning and uh, management reports that we communicate to the staff and the management team. Then general issues sort of dealing with customers, dealing with staff, any, uh, any issues that need my personal attention that I need to deal with as a priority. From there, sort of other formal or informal discussions again with my team and uh, then into the crux of the day, the planning for the future and, and the strategy and, and where we stand versus um, our targets. At the moment, I'm uh, with the Gordons Institute of Business Science. We're busy with an imperial management program, a sort of high-level um, team-driven program. I'm setting achievable goals. Um, to me, you don't succeed if you set goals that are, are not achievable. Building strong teams, having strong people around me, having the correct support structures, and again, having some fun doing that. Don't be scared to make decisions. Um, people will make mistakes, and, and the best business people we have in this country have made mistakes. But learn from your mistakes. Don't make them twice or three times. Learn, move on. Have faith in yourself to make the decision. Believe that you've evaluated the risk. The qualities I need to work on would be my patience. I am sometimes due to the pressures of the day and the pressures of this business, I probably need a bit of work on my patience. And on the emotional equity side, I could probably be a little bit more caring when it comes to my staff. I've been in this business for the majority of my working career. So all my achievements are, are business related or motor industry achievements and are very similar due to the nature of the business. To, to pick one out would probably be uh, here at Lindsay Saker Ravonia. So my greatest achievement sort of in the last couple of years would definitely be the turnaround of Lindsay Saker Ravonia. The most important qualities for me in a person will be integrity, honesty and a sense of humour. I think you learn to become successful through practice to be honest. I think um, You'll make mistakes and you'll have successes. Make sure you absorb, absorb what you learn and success will be inevitable. My business dream at the moment would be uh, to keep Lindsay Saker where it is, uh, at the top of the pile in a lot of the, the key points that our partners and our shareholders look at. Um, and besides keeping it at the top of the game, would also be to continuously improve Lindsay Saker. How I will work on achieving it is um, sticking to my guns, keeping my feet on the ground, um, maintaining the clear strategies that we've had in the past, setting achievable targets, keeping together this close, stable management team and stable workforce that we've managed to maintain in this business over the last couple of years. Focus on the customer and focus on, on the detail.